Hey everyone, so today is Friday, April 10th, and this is BLCD number two um, for me, and it's actually BLCD number three for the hubby. Um, so we loaded this past, I don't want to say weekend, this past week we loaded uh, like Monday, Tuesday, Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, I believe it was, or Saturday, Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, something to that effect. Anyway, um, I took an extra day to load. <laughs> So, hubby loaded Sunday, Monday, Tuesday. He started VOCD on Wednesday. And then I actually took, like I said, an extra day to load just to get in, out any cravings, any type of last minute things that I want. Um, I woke up that day and I remember thinking like, oh my God, I so want this, 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 and this, and this. And so I had asked hubby like, what should I do? And he was like, just get it out, this, get it out your system. He was like, that way it won't be taught to you, you know, the whole time. And you're thinking, oh, God, I wish I had, I wish I had. Um, so I just decided to load an extra day. Um, and I didn't even go full, full all in from that particular day. I really didn't. I just kind of ate whatever I wanted. But I um, didn't really do right to capacity or over capacity how I had been doing. So I honestly didn't even gain anything from that load day. Like over the loading, I probably gained like six to seven pounds, um, but I didn't gain anything that last load day, like nothing. So, <laughs> so um, I don't know if that's good or bad, <laughs> but I didn't gain nothing. Um, I was happy with not gaining nothing, honestly. Um, anyhow, so on to VOCDs. Um, but me and the hubby are doing really good. He he's doing awesome. He hasn't cheated, and I'm pretty happy about it. Um, he has such a hard time sticking to protocol when we when we go on, you know, together. And he said that part of the issue is like right now he feels like, you know, he feels like she feels tired. He feels like, hey, I need to do something about my weight. And he said part of the problem is that when he doesn't feel like that, then he feels the need to not want to stick to it. And so um, I'm hoping that that doesn't happen this time, but we'll see. Um, and I just gonna do my very best to like encourage him and keep him motivated and everything like that um, but in any case you know he's doing pretty good so far I'm doing good um, his VLCD1 he actually lost 3.4 or something um, and then VLCD2 he woke up this morning with another 3.6 down so he's already down like 7 pounds which is you know, phenomenal. <laughs> well, we know eight, how ACG works, right? So, well, of course, this first week, you're going to have amazing results. Um, and then, even with me, yesterday was my first VOCD, and I woke up this morning, and I was down 5.2 pounds. And I was like, yes, you know, like that was awesome. I was so happy to be down at 5.2. Um, and then we'll just kind of see what tomorrow brings. Um, I haven't I have very, very rarely followed Dr. Simeon's to the T, and why, what I mean by that is I always have broccoli, um, you know, or some of the vegetable that uh, is not uh, his manuscript. I've had string beans sometimes, and but this is not often. But yeah, so when I say I was good or I was perfect um, protocol, I'm talking about my own protocol, not Dr. Simeon's. Um, and then I have some steak strips, some John Soleil steak strips, which were delicious. Oh my god, they were so good. Um, I had that today for lunch and some broccoli. And then I also uh, had some strawberries and stevia. Well, that was last night. Cause I had, last night I had a sweet craving. I wanted something sweet. So I had strawberries and stevia. It took that craving right out. So I was, I was like, oh god, this is heaven. That's what I said. I was like, the strawberries and stevia is heaven, it's heaven sent. And um, I just had, you know, chugged my water down, so I still like drink, try, try to do, do four liters. I've been getting a good three, and it's only two days in, but so far I've been doing at least three, and I'm pretty happy with the three liters. So everything's going good, it's on the up and up um, for us in that aspect. Now I have my own issues. And I guess it's just because, okay, so I had three, basically three weeks off protocol, you know, um, to where I wasn't following P2. 
and even before I got on P2, I still had like a couple of days where I was just like, oh, screw it. I'm going to cheat and have something um, this last round. And my friends never, you know, haven't said anything about hanging out or whatnot. Um, and now, like, one of my friends just having a birthday party at night. She wants me to hang out with her. And I'm like, it's Friday night and I have to get up and go to work in the morning. I don't know. Like, I told her I would come, but I'm not sure. And it's kind of hard to go out and not drink. But I don't want to mess this up. And I don't want to mess up my first week. Because um, my friends want me to hang out with them. And then I also have uh, tomorrow, somebody just asked me today while I was at work, like, why don't you come? And we're having a little gathering for drinks and food. And I'm like, thinking to myself, like, no, I'm not coming. I'm so sorry, but I won't be able to make it. I can't. I just, I don't want to go out and put myself in, I don't want to go have, have a social gathering and put myself in a position to where I'm so tempted that I'll cheat. You know, I don't, I don't think my willpower is there yet to where I can be like, yeah, sure, I'll be around y'all and all this food and not have any of it. I don't think my willpower is there yet. And I don't want to put myself into that type of predicament or that type of situation to where... Um, I'm so so tempted and then let's say I am out and if I do have a drink whatever you know let's say I do have a drink maybe I don't mix it I'll just have a shot of, or two or whatever but then my inhibition gets lowered and I'm like oh whatever I can have what I want I don't want to put myself in that predicament and it's so still the first week it's still only a few days in I don't want to do that to myself um, I mess this up and then not only that, but shoot, the hubby, I got home from work and the hubby's like, do you want to go out to our favorite restaurant where we do go sometimes on P2? And we have steak and asparagus. Only thing is, is that um, nine times out of ten when we go there, I don't, I don't just eat like half the steak like I should. And I already had some steak strips earlier today. And I was like, no. I'm like, no, honey, I, I, I don't want to tell. I'm like, no, because if I do that, I'm definitely going to overeat. Um... And I won't have a loss tomorrow, and I don't want to hinder myself in that aspect. So it was just like, no, like, no. So <laughs> I don't know. I guess I'm just a little frustrated at my friends that want me to hang out with them. And I just kind of feel like I wish they understood where I'm coming from when I say, well, I'm on a very strict diet. I can't do it. I'm on a very strict diet. I can't have what you have. It. I'm on a very strict diet. I can't drink. Like, they don't understand that. And it frustrates me that they don't flip and understand it. But the kids are making them something to eat. Um, so I got the older, the older boys. <laughs> I'm making them cook. <laughs> but I still have to smell the stuff, so that still gets a little, a little, um, you know, daunting. A little, a little sensation, but not much. Not as much as it would be as if um, I was out with everybody. You know, in the house, I can go in my bedroom, close the door. I ain't got to be worried about it. Um, okay. Go sit down, okay? Stay away from yourself. Um, in my house, I don't have to be so much worried about it. I just uh, go in my room, close the door. Okay, this is beginning to get long, and I didn't want it to. Anyway, I will see you all later. <laughs> See you all tomorrow for VLCD 3 and VLCD 4, and then I'll give you all all our stats. Um, if I don't do it tomorrow, I might do it Sunday. Anyway, I'll see you all later. Peace, love, and everything. Bye, just.